welcome to my channel made with love by sarah so today i just thought we'd do a quick and easy card from this make and send card making pad it's from crafters companion and it's got four designs in it and it's got everything you need to make i don't know how many cards um but the four different designs are we've got these with the butterflies so you you rip out a sheet so it's so you rip out this sheet and then it's got the card base it's got the decorations and on this one it's got the envelope to match the liner for the inside some cutter parts so that's all you need just two two sheets so i've ripped some out and let's get started so today we're going to do this lilac one you do need a cutting machine or a pair of scissors or a guillotine or a, a trimmer so let's get the trimming i've got not got anything ready i just thought we'd do it from um from the beginning let's get my guillotine and start cutting up so i'm just going to cut a cut the card blank and i'll leave those for now this is the lining for the card so let's just give that a Cutter. We've got the envelope. And I'll leave those to see what we need to to decorate. So I'll just get my scoreboard. So this measures. Twelve inches, so I will just score it at. So actually, we need to cut it down a bit more because it's not not level. So let's get that cut down a bit more. Make the border even. So I'm just going to eyeball it and get the border even. And then it'll fit nicely. In our card. Think about there. Let's, let's do it there. Yep. So this now measures eleven and three quarters. What I can do is just fold this in half. It's on the thing. Just fold it, give it a press with a bone fold. And as you can see, it's decorated on both sides. So that's just ready just to stick in our card. I'll score this card blank. So you've got a planar side, I'm going to use that as my middle. This will be the outside. So I'm just going to score it where the patterns change. Give that a fold. Make sure it's nice and square. I pop it in the corner of my board just to make sure it's square. And then just give that a burnish. And there we have our card. Blank and base. So when you're gluing this in, as you can see, it fits nicely in the middle. You can either put the glue along the front, just a line so it joins onto this side, 
or you can pop it on on the back so it joins onto this side i think i'm going to put it on the back so just a little line of glue push that into the fold make sure it's nice and level just give that a bit of a press and when we open our card we've got this in the middle so that's it that's our card blank made i'm going to stand this one up as a as a tent fold i'll just give that another burnish so now it's time to decorate so we can cut apart these these things here you just pop them out so what sort of card are we going to make uh, I'm going to put hmm, I don't know which to use. Just pop out some butterflies. As you can see, they're really easy to pop out. I want to use that circle. We've got some nice flowers there. Okay, let's see what we can make with those. Don't like that green. I like that purple. I think we need some foam pads. Let's pop these up on, on some foam. So I'm going to go with the So Happy For You. And I'll just pop that on the front. So as you can see, they're really easy to make. They're not, not difficult. You buy everything and it's just all ready for you just to use. We'll pop that in the middle. And we'll have a... I don't actually feel like I want to put much on it. I don't think it needs much. Do you have a flower down at the bottom? As you can see, they have like little, little where they've been just still joined into the paper. You can just give them a little trim or you can leave them. Yeah, pop the flower down at the bottom. Um, let's go for a butterfly at the top. So I'm just getting my porky tool just to give this butterfly a bit of shape. Let's just put some tacky glue in the corner. So I'm putting that in the top corner to offset this in the bottom corner. I don't think I'm happy with that front. So let's put something in in here. What's it say at the front? So happy for you. We have it's time to shine. And I'll just stick this down with um, tacky glue. Put 
put that in the middle. Yeah, I'll put that little circle. I like this circle. So I'm just cutting off these little. Don't know what you call them. Just cut them off. Bit of glue in the middle. My glue doesn't want to come out. No, that's not done. Put that up there. That's nice. <coughs> well, then I think we'll just. Do we need to? I oh, will go so proud of you in the middle. Stick that on flat. Then we'll leave that to write on. I think we might just actually we'll just stick a little butterfly in the top corner. And I'll save these things for another card. So that's it, that's our card made. So we've got nice on the front. Just stick a butterfly. Mm. I think we'll have a pop some little gems on. Actually, I'll put them on here. And my pen. There we go. I've got a bit of a blockage in my glue. One there, one there, one there. I'm just using the end of my pocket tool just to pick up the gems. And there we have it, there's our card. So now to the envelope. So we have in the envelope little notches in all four sides. But we just need to let's just cut them out. And we've got the lines where we need to score. Might need to just trim this down a little bit more. I will. I'll trim it down. So it shows you your lines where you need to be and where you need to put. Perfect for beginners, these card kits. That's that. I'm going to score it along these, along the lines. 
you can either line it up in a track on your scoreboard or use a, a ruler or because it's only paper you can just actually just fold it So I've only scored lightly. And we need to fold and give it a burnish. I'm just going to trim off my edges, make it lay, lay nicer. That should be fine. Just giving it a little trim where where I think it needs it. Get all the burnish. And then we just pop some glue down each of these sides. a thin bead of glue all the way down press that down and your glue. Now we have our envelope. So I'm going to cut this strip off the bottom to decorate the envelope. Oh, I like that side. I'm going to use this side. Pop our Kalal All Purpose Glue on. I'm going to leave a bit of a gap at the bottom. Just press that all the way along. And then just Cut off the end. Let's get some bigger scissors. Okay, so that's that on our envelope. That's looking nice. And then I'll just pop these three little flowers. And 
Now remember the look. And there's a card, an envelope finished. So these card kits are very, very easy. So I'm going to make another one and um, I'll show you that one at the end. And there we have it, two finished cards and two decorated envelopes. It's very quick, very easy. Uh, so if you can buy a make and send pad, just give it a go. Thank you for joining me today, spending your time with me, I appreciate it. And if you've got any questions or any comments just let me know below give us a thumbs up if you like what you've seen and please subscribe to my channel and um if you ring the bell then you will get notified whenever i put a new video up so have fun crafting and i'll see you again in the next video bye